Hesperia Hardcore Highlights brought to you by Juice It Up in Hesperia's Gateway Shopping Center. Juice It Up, high school sports highlights. Hesperia at Granite Hills in a game containing all the intensity of a contest with playoff implications. The Cougars mark their territory early, often aggressively, but desert dwellers know and understand a scorpion's longevity exceeds that of a cougar. A scorpion's sting not immediate in its final fatal effect, but when the cougar has been cornered and stung, its fate has been determined. Granite Hills played their best basketball of the season the first quarter. Their aggressive, trapping defense creating turnovers and points off turnovers to the tune of 22 first quarter points. In the process, they hold the visiting Scorpions to nine. Six one junior Dornell Norwood, the game's first basket on the follow up. Elijah Wilman in control after the takeaway to Michael Granger. It's thirteen four. Hesperia's first field goal does not come until nearly five minutes in. Alex Hammond with the hoop. Elijah Wilman responsible for much of the early onslaught. The 5'11 junior with the jumper making it 17-9. Wilman scores 13 of his team I-21 the first half. This fast break basket on the Rodney Armour assist closes out first quarter scoring. Granite Hills 22, Hesperia 9. Wilman's next basket, this one on the Richard Lopez assist, opens up the Cougars' biggest lead of the night, 26-9. This possession offsets a Scorpion 11-6 run. Tan is junior co-captain Rodney Yarber with the excellent drive on the baseline. Cougars lead at halftime 34-20. The Scorpions score first in the second half where they did much of their first half scoring at the free throw line. Wanya Anderson. Asperia's long climb back continues on Anderson's basket. Joseph Padilla with the feed 34-24. At a later point, Cougars fans will feel victimized by Tommy John surgery, but in fact, these two veteran officials did an admirable job of controlling the game. Padilla on the out-of-bounds play and Anderson assist. Two minutes into the third, the Cougars' 14-point halftime lead whittled down to nine. Padilla will lead Hesperia with 20. Willman's basket, the Cougars' first field goal of the second half, restores a double-digit lead, 38-27. It's the long-range sharpshooter Padilla who hits again, 38-30. And again from short range. Granite Hill's lead cut to six, 38-32. We are at the midway mark of the third. Coach Sergio Lugo's plan of attack, simple enough. Move the ball quickly to avoid the double team. Eventually the postman will deliver. The low post, Wanya Anderson. No look pass from John Reyes. Granite Hills not buckling under the comeback. Another excellent Rodney Yarber drive shot. It's 42-36 Cougars at the two minute mark of the third. Yarber gets the next Cougars basket, intercepting and taking it to the hoop. At the end of the third, 44-39 Cougars. Yarber will finish with 17. Wilman's last basket opens fourth quarter scoring, 46-39. Wilman's 21, a game high. Free throws factor in, Rafa Kakish brings Hesperia within two, 50-48. Alex Hammond goes coast to coast to tie the game at 50, four minutes remain. It's Jose Padilla's three from the corner that gives Hesperia their first lead, 53-51. Well, say, what did you feel you had to do or want to do in order to get this team over the hump? Uh, I just felt like I needed to provide the spark by making my shots and finding the open pass and just doing what coach told me to do. Padilla is 20, 33, Kakish. Wilman with the interception, losing it to Norwood. It's Kakish to Jimmy Castaneda, 55-51, 2.45 to play. Dornell Norwood answers on the Wilman assist. 55-53, Hesperia. Norwood scores 16 this night. 
What transpires next is essentially the money shot. Anderson, rebound, Reyes is one, Padilla to Reyes, back to Padilla, inside to Anderson with the toughest shot he makes, 57-53, one minute to play. These points, the most crucial of Anderson's 12. Alex Hammond adds an equally important basket to make it 57-55. Cougars forced to foul. Jimmy Castaneda's free throw eliminates the three-point option for the Cougars. Norwood's basket at the buzzer makes the final score Hesperia 63, Granite Hills 61. Jose, this was an incredible, another come from behind win. What did the coach tell you at half? Uh, he just told us we gotta keep on fighting. There's no way we should be down because we're better than that. And we came out and we had to come out with some intensity and we did that. Juice It Up brings you Hoops Highlights. Juice It Up in Hesperia's Gateway Shopping Center.